Mobility is essential to mission success in the battle space. When a vehicle is active, operational, and on the move, warfighters often experience communications range issues and difficulties with different subsystems which can inhibit mission effectiveness. The U.S. Army Aberdeen Test Center used its automotive expertise to develop and build a new Electromagnetic Environmental Effects E3 dynamometer test facility to perform E3 testing of a vehicle on the move and to identify and help remedy E3 issues earlier in the testing cycle. Satisfying both requirements during an automotive project means the vehicle must be moving and under rotational load requirements the ATC's E3 dynamometer can accommodate during E3 testing for any wheeled vehicle with up to four axles. Commercial dynamometer testing also revealed vulnerabilities that allowed a vehicle's throttle to be opened, uncommanded, thus putting the vehicle in an unsafe condition. However, commercial E3 dynamometer facilities are unable to support military vehicle weight, leaving the E3 capabilities of military vehicles on the move untested, posing a safety risk to our warfighters. The Army and ATEC are implementing ATC's E3 dynamometer to discover vulnerabilities during testing so issues can be addressed and resolved earlier in the test program. ATC's E3 dynamometer facility is the only E3 dynamometer in the DoD. It can support most wheeled vehicles with up to four axles, with weights as heavy as 76,000 pounds. Each axle carriage can consume or provide up to 187 horsepower of rotational load directly to each axle. Testing under rotational load is useful to exercise the regenerative braking features on hybrid or electric vehicles. To improve testing efficiency, the turntable can rotate the vehicle while operating on the dynamometer in front of a stationary E3 testing antenna. In support of Army modernization, ATC's E3 dynamometer helps testers and developers identify and resolve E3 issues of a vehicle under rotational load while it's still in the testing phase. ATC is postured for the future ensuring our warfighters get the best, most effective gear.